About a month ago, I left everything I knew to be comfortable and flew across the world with a half crooked leg to continue my studies at the University of Pennsylvania. This is what it's been like. For the last eight months, all of my stuff had been stored at a family friend's house. Because I still can't lift any heavy stuff, I'm so glad that my dad was able to come along and help me move in. I mean, he was doing somewhat of a good job. I don't understand. Yes, go dad. <laughs> You're an embarrassment. <laughs> and yeah, school's cool and all, but it was so nice being back with my friends again. Hi! Hi. Welcome, Welcome back! back. Christine's YouTube channel. <laughs> like and subscribe. That's so awesome. <laughs> Stop dabbing. <laughs> I can tickle my own feet. <laughs> can you do that? Yeah, see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm schizophrenic. Yeah, it's Friday. Yeah, it's Friday. Schizophrenic. Yeah, it's Friday. 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 But there are also times when I begin to miss home and all of the freedom and time I used to have. I really miss the people, but I also really miss my dog. Hello! Then my friend from Australia came to visit. And yes, I know that Australia and New Zealand aren't the same place, but she did bring a little bit of familiarity back to me. I decided to show her around New York and take her to some of my favourite places. I've celebrated a couple of pretty special occasions, including a lot of birthdays and even Chinese New Year. know me I love food so of course I've eaten a lot of food and also done a lot of baking Back home in New Zealand, I was also obsessed with making platters, so yep, I brought that here too. So that's a bit of a recap on how I've been. 
I'm really enjoying my time so far, but midterms are coming around, so I should probably study now. See you later.